I've got some awesome news. Today is officially my one week anniversary at being at my new job. And I'm also driving my new truck. So this job was kind of a surprise to me. Ricky and I were driving somewhere a couple of weeks ago and we passed by a florist and Ricky was like, hey, they're hiring for delivery drivers. And I was kind of like, mm, you know. A few days later, I was going up to Gore's Nursery, which is a local nursery here that I had gotten an application from a couple months back and I never took it in. I went up there to see if they were still hiring and I chickened out, even though I thought it might be a pretty perfect job for me if I could work in the back with plants and all that stuff. Chickened out, couldn't do it. So as I was leaving there, the florist is right down the road and I found myself turning into the florist. I was feeling pretty good that morning. Pulled in there, walked into the shop. It was nice and quiet and calming and I asked if they were still looking for delivery drivers. She gave me an application. And she says if you can hang out for a few minutes, the owner will be back and he can interview you right now. So I hung out for a few minutes and met the owner, sat down with him, and um, I got a job. <laughs> uh, so I'm really excited. Delivering for a local florist. They have company vehicles I get to drive. Pay is decent, starts off $10 an hour, and I basically get to work by myself. And beautiful flowers and nice, quiet, calm, soothing people. Maybe four people at a time, sometimes just three in there. They're all very nice, there's no drama. <laughs> and it's pretty much a come and go kind of job. I know exactly what I need to do. I get to bring flower arrangements to people and put smiles on their faces. I mean, it's a little more complicated than that. It's not complicated at all, but there's more to it. Like we deliver to hospitals and we do funeral arrangements and stuff like that. So it can get a little more detailed, but for the most part, I come to work and I get to ride around with beautiful flowers all day. I am learning different aspects of the floral business. I guess that's what you call it. And eventually I will learn to make arrangements. So that's awesome. One week there, I'm loving it. I, it's, I, I could not have asked for a more perfect job, I don't think. And I, I'm so thankful God has been listening to my prayers and it, it all worked out. It's amazing. And then the other really awesome news is this truck here. I will show you the, the, the whole thing at a later time, but I'm just sitting out in this parking lot right now and I figured I'd tell you. So it's a 2004 uh, Ford Ranger Ricky bought for me, um, basically as a birthday gift. I mean, not really, but it happens to be my birthday this week. He bought it for me a couple weeks ago. We drove it for about a week, and then it had some issues. He had to fix some things to get it running anyway, but we got a really good deal on it, and we broke down last week, <laughs> and I thought for sure it was a goner, and I was trying to figure out how I could get money to get a bike to get to work because I didn't want to lose this awesome new job that I just got. But he he worked and until he figured it out. Bless him. He's just, he's very knowledgeable and very dedicated and I'm, I'm very thankful. So it is up. It's running. It's doing great. It's so nice to have my wings back, my freedom. Because being stuck without a ride and having to depend on other people really sucks. I'm super excited. I just wanted to share that with you guys. I'm working. It's something I, I really believe. I, I can't see myself leaving this job just, you know, for the sheer fact that it's it's perfect. Why would I want to leave it and then have to worry again and struggle getting and losing jobs? This is awesome. And I'm, I, I couldn't be happier. Hi, guys. work this morning you guys I uh, just finished up two deliveries and I'm actually going to a wholesaler right now to pick up some supplies and I thought I would come on say what's up I was feeling a little anxious this morning and this 
despite the fact that I um, I love this job, I, I didn't want to go in, but I'm here. And I think what happened was I had two hours all along to prepare for my day, which for me is, is just not a good idea. I'm learning that it's probably best for me to wake up right before I have to go to work because if I already have time to think about it, I have time to get anxious. Learn something new about myself. y'all see that no you cannot see it the signs don't show up very well but my new job they've known me for what a week and a half now <laughs> and they remembered my birthday meanwhile my ex was with me for eight years and forgot my birthday every single year Look at all the pretty flowers today. It's getting closer to Mother's Day, so it's picking up. It's gonna be really busy Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday from what I hear. Kind of excited. 